So a lot of times uh, a C-level executive, a surgeon, uh, a, a type A person uh, who is used to being in control, they call the shots, they know what to do, they're very good at it, uh, but in, in contrast during a divorce, those type of tactics that make them a smashing success in their business life will be detrimental in a divorce frequently. Uh, microman trying to micromanage the lawyer or tell the lawyer what to do, oddly enough, always winds up costing more. Uh, and it, it kind of frequently gets expectations out of whack that uh, people in sort of linear careers like that, if we do ABC, we're going to get to the result. And in divorce, that's not always the case. Another thing for executives that's kind of frequently surprising is many times, though they're extremely plugged into their career and what they do and, and running their operation with perfection. Uh, they're not plugged into what's going on at home with the kids or their personal finances and not knowing that they're overspending their budgets more than their income or not sort of thinking out, okay, what are we going to do for the kids' college and, and, and frequently um, that winds up being an issue in a divorce because they don't know all the answers and all the issues. If someone's uh, thinking they're about ready to go through a divorce, they should try to educate themselves on what are our finances, what are we spending each month, where, where are all of our accounts, where are our assets, and frequently this happens for an executive spouse that they don't know. They need to educate themselves about that financial information. It's extremely important. 